During the lockdown, the wild nature of our planet's species began to show how quickly they can retake urban dwellings long conquered by humans. Animals seem to have gotten a fresh wind of confidence with the absence of human behaviour, but for the residents in Queensland, Australia, a nightmare is unfolding that could see the city of Sydney being overrun by mice. Wait to hear this. A plague of mice is sweeping Australia, and the only way authorities know how to stop them could see other species like parrots completely wiped out. And the mice are rampaging through southeastern parts of Australia, gnawing through cables, burning homes, devastating farmlands, and shutting down communications. Blamed on an exceptional harvest of crops, making breeding conditions rife for the plague, with one mouse capable of producing a colony of over 400 in a matter of a few short months. And now farmers fear they could go underground for spring hibernation and re-emerge having bred underground and completely obliterate wide swathes of foodstuffs that are currently growing. They could re-emerge just as the food ripens and authorities are being encouraged to act now before it's too late as traumatised citizens are getting inventive on how to expose the tiny pests. With the mice populations now doubling every two weeks, Time is running out to control this unprecedented outbreak by realistic means. Billions of rampaging mice have sparked horrific outbreaks stretching from Brisbane down to Melbourne and tormenting farmers for eight months solid. A mouse can live up to three years and female mice can start reproducing at just six weeks and they can give birth to ten babies every three weeks and the mum can get pregnant again the very next day after giving birth with experts warning that without a concentrated baiting effort in the next few weeks, this could easily turn into a three-year plague event. Napalm for mice has been developed and will be used when approved in a $50 million effort to combat the outbreak. But the next problem, if they can kill so many mice, will be the stench and disease that this will spread as a result of this action. Supermarkets in these areas are decimated with countless tons of food being disposed and constant cleaning of areas where food is stored. And local residents, as well as workers in these communities, are already complaining that the stench is utterly unbearable and it's easy to feel hopeless in such situations. But what do you guys think about the desperate situation of mice sweeping Australia? Comments below, and as always, thank you for watching.